Meanwhile, scientists in the United States have created tiny biological robots from human tracheal cells. Now, these robots are known as anthrobots. Now, these microscopic multicellular bots have displayed a remarkable healing effect on other cells. They have been designed to self-assemble and can vary in size. They can be as wide as the width of a human hair to as tiny as the point of a sharpened pencil. The discovery was part of research conducted by Professor Michael Levin at Tufts University in the U.S. in collaboration from Harvard University's WYSS Institute. Anthrobots are the first fully cellular living biological robots made up of human cells. Similar to how a tiny planted seed autonomously develops and grows up to be a plant, each one of these biological robots, an anthrobot, also develops from a seed, a single human cell planted into an extracellular matrix, into this multicellular motile machine. Anthrobots made from adult human tracheal cells can move autonomously and encourage neuron growth without modifying their DNA. In other words, anthrobots have the potential to heal wounds. Researchers believe that in the future, anthrobots can be used for repairing spinal cord or retinal nerve damage, recognizing bacteria or cancer cells and delivering targeted drugs. There are numerous potential uses for anthrobots in personalized medicine and bioengineering. In the future, we may be able to take a person's own cells and use precisely designed stimuli to get them to adopt desired shapes and behaviors. We could reinsert them back into the body to have them perform therapeutic tasks, such as sensing tumors or pathogens, laying down pro-regenerative molecules, scraping plaque off of artery walls, or repairing wounds or other defects.